So recently, Amazon sellers took a pretty big hit with these tariff taxes. Now, depending on how much you were affected, I'm about to show you how you don't have to rely on sourcing products from China to get you high quality products. I'm about to go over different manufacturer options you have that you can essentially add to your Rolodex to allow you to continually stay profitable and succeed on Amazon in 2019. Let's check it out now. All right, so let's check out the very first website. Now this website has a pretty long URL. Uh, I'll have a link to both of these marketplaces in the description so you can check it out. Um, but the first one we're gonna be going over is India. So the Indian marketplace has one of the higher GDPs uh, globally and it's it's growing at a pretty quick rate. So it's very important now that you wanna, when you're considering diversifying your manufacturer portfolio, if you will, to really consider India. Now, again, this website is not as popular as um, Alibaba, but you can type in, for example, let's just go off of this right here. You can type in essentially any keyword, and India is really starting to grow in their um, product quality. You know, it's just as high quality as it is in China. And look, look how many suppliers, just from, you know, one of the suggested search terms here, um, 2,181 suppliers. That's pretty impressive. And so you can do approach it exactly the same way you would approach a manufacturer on Alibaba, for example. You know, you if you need anything customized, if uh, you if you need specific um, packaging designs, there are a array of suppliers here that will help you with that. And um, not all manufacturers are also going to be from India. They also have some from Europe in here, I believe. Um, but for the most part, they should have, you know, a, a considerable amount of products depending on what you want. And um, it's worth investing the time to, you know, if you're affected on some of these product, on some of these tariffs, you know, who knows how long they're going to last, really. It's really important to consider looking at other options. So I'll have a link below. This is the Indian version of Alibaba. And now let's go ahead and go to the USA version of Alibaba. And this one's called thomasnet.com. Again, the link will be in the description. And then here you can, you can just type in, you know, your product. Let's just type in beauty products. And this is primarily all going to be USA manufacturers, okay? So these, the if you have some sort of a supplement or a topical product, beauty product of any kind, um, because Amazon's very particular with the in, with the people that they let into gated products, this is also a strong marketplace to vet suppliers. Because Amazon is really hardcore with their gated products. So if you didn't want to enter a gated category, I would really suggest, you know, before doing a general search on Google, um, take a look at thomas.net because this is a directory of all USA manufacturers. And this will help you when you're looking to do product research for any of your Amazon products. So it's really cool. And you can just go here and you know, message a few at a time and, and get back your prices and your quotes. And just like you would in Alibaba with the 30% down, 40% down, and with the rest being complete upon um, the product completion, you can just talk to manufacturers here directly, right? Go to the direct the directories. Um, it'll allow you, it'll save you so much time. But I really do think that if you're highly affected by these tariffs, it's really worth, you know, testing the Indian marketplace. This one's going to be a little bit more robust. This one's going to be a lot quicker. Might be a little more expensive because it's sourced in the USA, but getting into gated products is going to be much, much easier. Um, and there was a other one in the European marketplace, but I do know that some of the taxes might have been high. So maybe I'll go into the European marketplaces in, in another video. But just to, get, just to get you guys started, you know, Alibaba is still a strong option. You're just paying a little bit more for now, but these are two really, you know, as you, the years go on, you're going to really start to see the diversity in these marketplaces grow and grow um, because China's dominated it for so long. But with some of these 
tariff wars, if you will, there's a lot of uncertainty in the air. So it's it's really really important to consider diversifying and you know try a few experiments, right? Try a few experiments. Order a small sample size. Run the product with that. You know, do your due diligence just like you would in China. And um, yeah, th this is a really strong option for you guys. Now, I just released a video on product sourcing hacks. This will allow you to save time on shipping and on product costs and allowing you to take full control of your fulfillment methods and full control over how fast you're getting your products. Check out my next video here where I break down step by step how to source products less expensively and put more money in your pocket as an Amazon seller. And also don't forget to join my private group. I'll have a link below in the description. It's a private group, but we are a very close-knit tribe and we would love to have you.